Fred Perkle grew up in the Texas Hill Country near San Antonio, where he was affectionately known as Shotgun Fred, a nickname he earned from his mother. After graduating high school, Fred attended San Antonio Junior College prior to coming to Sam Houston. But I went looking all around the state and I found Sam Houston, Theron East Texas. What a beautiful spot. Great little campus. Just the right size. And they had an industrial arts program. And so I said, this is for me. Lots of places to hunt, fish. And I even saw a few pretty girls. And that made my decision. After completing his Bachelor of Science degree in Industrial Arts, he went on to earn his Master of Arts in Industrial Technology with a minor in Marketing. He moved to Houston and taught Industrial Arts courses in the Cypress Fairbanks Independent School District, where he became a role model and leader of his students. He's a good teacher. You know, if you wanted to learn and you want you give some effort and try hard, you know, he'd spend all the time in the world with you. Fred's kind of a, a leader of leaders. He just, he's the smartest man I've ever known in my life. Hands down, no contest. Fred's scholarship in industrial technology led him to work in the business for several companies in Houston and then Pennsylvania, where he thrived in the Northeast's robust industrial environment. Pennsylvania became home as he met and married Linda, who had two daughters of her own. Their family grew with the addition of two sons, Fred Perkle Jr. and James Perkle. Perkle founded Therm Omega Tech Incorporated in 1982 in order to manufacture valves of his own patented design. The company grew to be a leader in the field of manufacturing temperature control valves and devices, gaining worldwide respect across diverse industries. Therm Omega Tech freeze protection valves have become the railroad industry standard for preventing freeze damage to diesel locomotives, annually protecting billions of dollars of railroad equipment worldwide. Over the course of time, Fred has patented over 20 products, all of which are manufactured in the Thermo Mega Tech facility in Warminster, Pennsylvania. I think he's photographic in the memory side because he reads things and he's so well prepared when he goes to into a project. It doesn't matter if it's a sales meeting or if it's a, a tool he's going to build or a, uh, a valve, or whatever it happened to be. Uh, he comes to the game ready to go. He's driven. He's very successful because he knows the processes to make these things happen. With his love of barbecue and passion for cooking, Fred applied his valve technology to design the first temperature control device for charcoal grills and cookers, the Barbecue Guru which has revolutionized the outdoor cooking industry. Using these controls, Shotgun Fred and his barbecue team have collected numerous accolades. The memory of winning Jack Daniels International Barbecue Cook-Off in Lynchburg, Tennessee in 2009 is something I'll never forget. That's a one a lifetime thing. Known by many as a visionary, Perkle has the unique talent of turning dreams into reality. I realized when I was in grade school that I could visualize things from all directions. Top, bottom, left side, right side, as well as frontal view. Lucid dreaming is a process where you can actually control your dream so you can be in a kind of a sleep-awake state and you can control the outcome of the dream. It's a very effective designing tool because you can start with the abstract and make that abstract uh, practical. But he also credits hard work and perseverance as components of his success. Anything worth doing 
is worth working hard at. That's a nice thing about studying it in a school environment. You see what needs to be done, and you just do it. Budget your time. Budget your energy. Energy budgeting is even more important than time management and learning how to regiment yourself, how to do everything every day, how to double time. You know, use the energy you've got while while you've got it. Fred Perkle believes that life is a journey, not a destination. Through his journey, Fred has used his mind to rise to many challenges. Even as he deals with Lou Gehrig's disease, he has designed and manufactured equipment and tools that aid in his health care. Modern medicine doesn't figure out how to cure this guy. He may do it himself. I know Fred uh, with the drive he has and as smart as he is, you know, he can fight this to the end and he'll never give up. I mean, that's just Fred. With his never-ending quest for knowledge, Fred Perkle's advice to the world is to never give up. We've got to go out here and make a statement to the rest of the world. Americans are hard workers, and we're smart workers, and we can do, and we will do. And believe me, this country will come back with a vengeance if we all work hard at it. Ladies and gentlemen, please recognize Fred Perkle as a 2011 Distinguished Alumni.